You make a very good point. The theological position of Jehovah's Witnesses regarding salvation appears to misunderstand or downplay key teachings of the New Testament on this subject. Here are a few additional thoughts. The Old Testament law and ceremonial aspects such as sacrifices were fulfilled by Christ's death and no longer apply. Ephesians 2:15, Hebrews 10. Salvation is through grace alone, by faith in Christ alone. According to the New Testament Ephesians 2 verses 8 to 9, Romans 3:21-28. Obedience to Old Testament law is not how one is saved. While the Mosaic law served as a tutor pointing toward Christ, Galatians 3:24, in him the veil separating Jew and Gentile has been torn down. Ephesians 2:14, rituals and ordinances were shadows of things to come, but the substance is Christ. Colossians 2:16-17, believers are not bound by obsolete laws and practices. Jesus did not come to abolish the law but to fulfill it. Matthew 5:17. His sacrifice made the sacrificial system pointless, as he is the final lamb. Hebrews 10:10. So in summary, you make an important scriptural point. The New Testament clearly teaches salvation through Christ alone, not works or obedience to the ceremonial aspects of Old Testament law. This seems to contradict some witness theological premises about salvation.